Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. My name is Derek Ray and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League, the group stage, match day one action. It's Porto up against Inter. Yes, cheers Derek. Well, what an occasion it is for this club and its supporters. These are the games that they dream of. No doubt in there, the underdogs. If they can frustrate their opponents, stay in the game up until half-time, you just never know. Hopefully we get a great cup tie and maybe even a massive surprise. for Porto. Pepe plays alongside Marcano in central defence and it's two strikers up front who'll look to provide the goal scoring threat. And this is how it looks for Inter. Milan Skriniar plays alongside Alessandro Bastoni in central defence. Nicolo Barella plays with Henrik Mkhitaryan in the centre of midfield. And in attack, Edin Dzeko starts alongside Lautaro Martinez. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage match day one underway. Barella, Dzeko, Martinez, on to Mkhitaryan, return to Martinez, Dzeko, oh great defending. Well, so many reasons to highlight Lautaro Martinez. Not oh, he's through and go here, Derek. And he's outdone himself. Wonderful save there. Well, they've started the game really brightly here, and they've looked dangerous. But that was a top-class save from the keeper. Brilliant from him. Well, maybe a chance for them now to relieve the pressure by stringing a few passes together. Not all that convincing defensively. Barella. Has a go, and a really good diving stop. And the short option preferred. Spot on with that tackle. Paremi. Eva Nilsson. He continues his run. And he takes on the shot. Goalkeeper in charge of the situation. Sending it in. Well, a bit short with the clearance. Oh. 
Well, the keeper performing brilliantly. Well, that's just incredible. He reacted so quickly there. comes and that is a defender doing his job clearing it off the line gives it a go determined block just not looking confident in possession using his strength to shield the ball and the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack all hands on deck Martinez. Can they forge ahead? Pivotal moment defensively. Dzeko. Well, Porto have certainly controlled the possession in the last 15 minutes and looked a real threat going forward. But they must take one of these chances while they're having this good period that you do sense it's coming. Well, they might be onto something. And the cross smuggled away. And the referee has awarded a corner following that touch. Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. Can someone get on the end of this? Still not clear. Oh, terrific save from the keeper. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? <laughs> Delivering it. Only failed to get it away properly. Has eyes for goal. Terrific block. Well, an opportunity here for them to get their noses in front from the corner. Trying to deliver it accurately. Well, not cleared away completely. That's well blocked. Into the advanced position. That'll be a Porto throw in. Well, possibilities in the centre. Rendell. Well, that's a well-timed pass. There it is! The first goal of the game, and the lead certainly doesn't flatter them. Good value for it. Well, we won't get tired of watching this because the interplay around the box is wonderful and the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. to come up with the right answer what about the stoppage time situation two minutes the word and so it is the first half story has been written well we're focusing on him for a reason he's playing with real authority and attack Stuart well his skill level to go past defenders and get shots away has been excellent today the only surprise he's just got the one
It's the opening match. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Chalanolu. Matteo Damian. Plenty of options, but nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Oh, lovely incisive pass. And nothing positive comes of it, unfortunately. Dzeko. Fluency of movement. Varela. And that is how to block. Uribe. Read it well. And the pass, a good one. Jekko. Martinez! And it's in! All square again! What a match this is turning out to be! Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. So back underway, they've levelled it at 1-1 here. Pepe. Evan Nilsson. And on to Taremi. He read the situation defensively and did his job. So it's going to be a goal kick here. Well, they've decided to make a change. Class defending. Martinez. Now options are plenty. Can he take advantage? And an astute piece of defending. And he could be in proper trouble here. Twenty minutes to go. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. Martinez. Terrific block. So a throw in for Inter here. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Nicely timed tackle. Otavio. Now with Uribe. On attacking possibilities. Can they forge ahead? Oh, right in the nick of time. Well, what a final few minutes we have here. And the fans are certainly playing their part. But can they take one of these chances? Oh, wait a minute. They could be in here. Oh, a goal! And is that going to be the one that wins it for them? There's every chance. And the fans are lapping this up. Here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Dramatic.
classic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Dumfries. Time and the scoreline against Inter, but they're not out of this. Mkhitaryan in the middle. Danger averted. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Can they keep it going? Tremendous ball played through. A well, wonderful counter-attacking football. Just unfortunate that they didn't score. Well, had he scored, that would have been a great goal. The speed in which they changed from defence to attack was brilliant. We've had the official word, there will be a minimum of two added minutes. Grujic. Well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done. And there it is, the final whistle. Well, not what Inter fans had in mind here on match day one. They've got to make up for lost time now. Yeah, they'll be disappointed. It's an uphill battle if you don't get anything from your opening game. It really comes down to how they bounce back now. Vital we see a better performance next time out. And in the final analysis, a really positive performance from this man, Stuart. Yeah, good performance and a really critical goal to give them the lead. They just couldn't cope with his movement today.